to today's vlog. Can we talk about how freaking good this drink looks? And also before anyone comes for me and says, what happened to only drinking coffee black? Well, I got an espresso and I got the little froth thing that comes with it and it changed everything. It just is so much more fun to put milk in there. It's just too much fun. So scratch that, <laughs> I don't really care. But it's actually been quite a bit since we've talked. Hold on, let's just like have a quick little chat. I haven't vlogged in almost a week maybe. I'm trying to think of when I vlogged last and I do not know. I got really ahead with the vlogs because of all the moving stuff and I just had so much filmed that we got really ahead. So I just kind of took a little time off. I tried out my Nespresso for the first time. Look at how frothy the top is. This is just so fun. But I am back today. Oof, look at the sun coming in. It was a stormy night, okay? Like it actually woke me up how loud the lightning and thunder was yesterday. It was actually very scary. I was a little scared. I went to bed and it was like thunder and lightning out and it was kind of relaxing. I was like, oh, this is like, this is chill. Then at three in the morning, it was like hitting my window and I thought like, shit was going down and then it actually killed my power. So I have some lights that stay on throughout the night, like kind of like night lights. They're very dim, but they're there and they make me feel <laughs> safe and secure. But they went out and my little starlight thing went out. Like it was, it was a little scurry. That was my first like, like big storm here. Anyways, I'm just adjusting to weather and catching you guys up like friends do. But, 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 but today we're actually leaving for Montreal to move my brother to Montreal. We are moving him into his apartment. We are going there. We're getting him set up and ready for his first few days of work. So we're going to be gone for a whole week. It's crazy. Like we just did all my moving stuff. There's still things to be done. Actually, by the time we come back, my countertops should be installed. My dishwasher should also be installed. And then as soon as we're back, like that week, my couch should come. So things are lining up very nicely. Anyways, let's go get ready. Let's get ourselves together. Actually, super crazy, but Summer Fridays wanted to work with me and I am such a huge, like legitimately a huge fan of their products, their branding, like everything that has to do with them. I really love their CC Me Serum products. That is such a good product. If you're looking to brighten your face and like add a nice glow to it, the CC Me Serum, really does it. This is the product CC Me Serum. It is, first of all, the cutest packaging ever, plus it's fully recyclable. I'm gonna wash my face really fast and then I'll show you how I use this. Okay, so I usually use one or two pumps, depending on the day, I'm gonna use one and a half today. Kinda looks like, like this. <laughs> it helps get rid of dark spots, hyperpigmentation, and overall I just feel like it makes my skin look really, really nice. I'm not gonna like get myself ready today because I'm just gonna be sitting in a car for the next six hours. So on days like that, I just like to focus on my skincare. Okay, I'm gonna go on top with a moisturizer. If you're looking for some new products, I really genuinely recommend Summer Fridays. Not only do they absolutely nail the aesthetics and the branding, they also nail the actual product, which is obviously important. They have some really great ingredients in there. It's vegan, it's cruelty free, like it's just a, an amazing product. And the brand itself, like it's just 1010. I will link this down below if you wanna check it out. I really recommend, this is phenomenal. I really, really love it actually, let me put it back. I've been trying to keep organized. Anyways, I have to get myself together, get my stuff packed, figure out what I'm gonna bring to Montreal, and then I guess we will hit the road. Getting some skinny pop, white cheddar, and uh, shot the bar. Okie dokie. Hello vlog. Haven't talked to you in a minute. It's just my mother and I here in the car. We're, would you uh, like a piece? Of course I would like a piece, thank you. What is in a Wonder Bar? Oh, it's deliciousness. Mmm. We're actually, um, Almost there, kind of. It's 2.45 now, so I really haven't talked to you in many hours, but we've just been in the car, driving an hour and a half from my brother's new place, which is so crazy. We took two cars, so Jared took his own. I think I told you this earlier, actually. Dad, 
Okay, we have officially made it to Montreal. We are doing the setup. We have moved everything in. It actually wasn't so bad. We had like just two loads of stuff to bring. You can't get it? Just take the, the thing out maybe. I already put the knives and stuff here. Yeah. Jay, are you cool with me putting the Nespresso right next to the knives? Is it gonna do that? Um, yeah, that's, that's fine. Put it right here because there's an outlet right here. Yeah, exactly. Oh, God, Anyways, <laughs> we're setting everything up. Let's do it. <laughs> He actually got the same bar stools as me. My parents got him a nice little Dyson. Jay, do you know where you want your trays and stuff? Or should I just put it where just, I think best? Just put it where you think best. Okay. Setup team. Just bam, bam, done. I know, we're kind of crushing it. Let's face it, air fryers are. They're not the cutest thing to look at. There's no aesthetic. No. It's kind of fun to not be the one that's moving. Like. Really? Why? <laughs> I thought you liked it. I, you know, I'm kind of over it. Oh, this is a nice pillow, Jay. Okay. been quite the day i think it's like 6 30 now i don't know but we went to the dep new dep dep we went to the convenience store and we picked up some booze we got some beers some claws some more beer we still have to figure out what we're gonna do for dinner like food we actually can't go into any restaurants right now we have to go tomorrow to get a qr code because they have the vaccine passports here so we can't go to dinner just quite yet so i think we'll probably just order in but the sunset is happening. It's so exciting that he has like a nice sunset view. I'm very happy for him. It's very important. But yeah, we're just gonna crack some drinks, order some food. <laughs> Anyways, I will check back in when we head to where we're staying tonight. Um, Dad's already got fries. Cheers. Well, no, you take my fries. You have a vacuum there too. This is nice. What the heck? Okay, it is 8.30. I don't know, my phone is dead. But we had our dinner. I had this truffle mac and cheese, which we, we brought back. And we're in our our room. I don't know what's, how do I open this thing? But my dad is still at my brother's place setting up more stuff for him. Classic Mitchy things. But I'll give you a tour of this place. I'm not gonna give you guys a tour of my brother's. It's his space. He doesn't really want me to do a tour of it, but I will show you guys our place for the week. This is so cool, eh? So nice, the wallpaper. Anyways, here we go. Front door, and then you enter and you see the kitchen, the living area. There's a closet right over here. So this, I guess, is my bathroom, which is like so nice. They give you a mask and earplugs. No way, like a sleeping mask? Yeah, no. Oh no, <laughs> you never know. Okay, so this is the first bedroom. This is- This is your room. So freaking cute. Kitchen, so nice. Got us some bar stools. This is this is pretty sweet. Here's the living room. The wallpaper is super fun. Got a nice round mirror. I love this light fixture. This is like your mirror, right? Yeah, yeah. And then here's the other bedroom. I guess this is my parents. Oh, good. Another mask. Nice. Oh, wow. Look at this walk-in closet and then ensuite bathroom. Nice. What a sick place. How lovely. How nice, eh? Hey? Lovely. Anyways, I'm going to Get all my stuff together. I'm gonna unpack my bag, plug my phone in because it's been dead for a while. And then I guess I'm gonna pick this up tomorrow. Three, two, I'm wearing the same thing as yesterday. Good morning. Outfit okay, repeater. I know. <laughs> Thank you. It's a choice. It's a choice. It's a decision I made for many reasons, which I will expand on. Lovely day. Good morning, guys. It is the next day. I'm wearing the same thing that I wore yesterday because one, it's cozy. Two, I wanted to take a picture in it. Anyways, we're going to Jay's place, here about his first night, and then we're gonna start on a whole bunch of stuff. Just one, just press one. Oh yeah, then the Oh door. no, it's this one. Here, this is the one that opens. I thought we were locked in there for a second. Here come 
Thank you very much. Ooh. Anything else with that? Heck yeah. Oh my god. We got crepes for breakfast. Mine has pesto, avocado, asparagus, brie cheese, and spinach. And it looks like heaven. And then we got lattes. Mine has oat milk. Watch it. I am. S are you gonna push me into the plant? No, I was protecting you. No, you were pushing me right into it. Wanna clean your boots? You wanna clean your boots? Get on in there. Oh, nice. See? Very nice. Oh, look, some lamps. Very nice. Very nice. All right, we uh, had some lovely crepes. That was so good. We didn't have the QR code for the vaccine passport, but we did have our proof of vaccines, so we were able to actually sit inside and eat. We weren't sure if we were gonna be able to, but we were crossing our fingers. And now we're gonna go back to his apartment, grab the car, and then start getting some stuff. This place looks amazing. It looks so cute. We're gonna have to go here. Oh, I haven't been in this car in so long. First stop, Walmart. Get some essentials. Hey, chair. Oh, oh shit. Oh, it's not the exact same, but it's close. Nice. Okay, so we're getting some essentials like soap, toilet paper, other stuff, everything. We're getting it as much as we can here, but it's funny. I get so many questions asking, do you speak French? Does everyone speak French? We do not speak French. And in case you don't know, Quebec is very French. In Perth. Oh, microwave. Brilliant. Yeah, it's funny, like for breakfast, everything was French. Here, everything is French. So my brother's been doing Duolingo to learn, because obviously this is where he's gonna live, but Quebec is a very French, French province. It's just funny, because I'm like, I don't understand anything. I wish I could speak French. I think it's a beautiful language. I learned it in school. Dad, you learned French in school too, right? No. Yes, you did. Okay, I did. Oh, I don't know. Did you? No. I don't know if I can believe. I took it, but I didn't learn it. Okay. This makes sense. Does you make have sense? you have to learn it. You mean you have to learn it? You have to study it in school here. Anyways, we all studied it. <laughs> we didn't all learn it, but we all had to study it. My mom also doesn't speak French. She did grow up here. My grandparents speak a little bit of French. They currently live here. My brother wants to learn as much as he can. You can get little cups for your OJ in yeah, the morning. So like, okay, do you want this one or do you want a plastic one? I like the wood one. one. Does he need um, any of these? Like a no, he already has. Okay. Jared, if you want to make pancakes, something like this is good. Here, Jay, what, do you like this one? That's uh, nice. It's like a stove. And it matches the others. Okay, sure. We'll go get four, I guess. Don't get something too big. Your fridge isn't that big. Pepperoni. Oh, he needs Tupperware, yeah. Is there a, like a set of them? 32. Perfect. Jay, do you want like a portable mug? Like if you make your coffee in the morning oh, that's and then want to take idea. a tour? Traveler, yeah. Yeah. Do you like that one or like this Is white this, one? This wouldn't fit in, or maybe it would fit. You're right, yeah. you're right. Okay, then get, get like this guy. This one yeah, would fit. That would fit. There's a traveler. Gotta get a garbage can. Yeah, under, it's under the sink, so. Yeah, that's why I was well, maybe he'll just, But maybe he'll just put it on the side of the kitchen instead of putting it underneath. Yeah, right. you put it to the side of the sink. I yeah, get the, no, get the white because it'll match the rest of the kitchen. It's legit. <laughs> nice. Freaking insane, the amount of things that you need when you first move into a place. Like there's so many little things you kind of forget about that you need to like stock up on. Chocolate is one of those things, definitely. All right, we managed to get everything in here and now we're gonna put it all away. Maybe put his soaps out of the sink too. Okay, I'm gonna put his mugs. Okay, I'm gonna put your mugs in here. It's cute, eh? Okay, where do you wanna put your trash? We have been unloading things, setting things up here. We went and got groceries, we walked there, we walked back, we thought it was gonna rain on us, but it didn't. Very happy about that. Now we're gonna load the fridge, and then I think my mom and I are gonna go get coffee at this amazing looking spot. Once we put all this away. Oh, yeah. 345, ladies and gents. 
five o'clock somewhere. Mmm. <laughs> Ooh. Yum. Spritz. <laughs> Classic. We in a row. No, we're out. Ready? One, hold on, hold on. two, three, three, go. How was that? I feel like that was really aggressive. Oh, it's not bad. But maybe I should do it from this angle. Okay. Here, give me your phone. Two, one. I don't know if it's picking up as big as it is. New York style. Let's right. open. It smells good. Wow. Holy hell. Holy shit. Oh. So good. Yeah, Wait, the size of no one is understanding how big these are. Like, <laughs> please take a moment. I don't know if you can understand how actually large these are. It's like a New York slice. <laughs> they smell incredible. <laughs> Okay, I feel like you can get the perspective this here. This is so much fun. Okay, it is, I don't know what time it is, like nine. We just got back to our little condo. We are here for the rest of the week until next week. I'm actually not sure how much I will vlog. We will see, but lots of cool things happening at my house. I actually got like a big update today of things that they're doing while we're here, which is very convenient, obviously. So when we get back, which could be the next vlog or the vlog after that, lots of updates, like wrapping the thing up, which is really awesome. But I'm gonna end the vlog here. I hope you guys enjoyed watching it. My dad and my brother are watching the football game. We figured we'd come back and like start chilling. Anyways, I love you guys so much and I will see you in the next vlog. Bye.